guys, it's your girl Ashley here, and I'm here with a spoil me type video. Um, it's mine and my fiance's two years of being together, and I got spoiled like crazy today when we went out. Um, I want to show you my cute little nails that I did this week. Blue from the Dollar Tree, like I always do. You know, I do Dollar Tree nails because I love them. Then, like a sparkly. And then, which, sorry, my phone floors. Uh, it says book nerd and it's the same one as my green one I just got it in gray because these shirts are so comfy and they represent me and I just love them so I just got my comfy book nerd shirt on because honestly it's the best shirt in the world um I'm gonna say the best for last so I also joined Weight Watchers I'm gonna give you guys a whole thing about that I've yet to get weighed in because every time I go to get weighed in at my Weight Watchers place they're closed so <laughs> I'm going to get weighed in I want to say either Thursday or Friday so once I do that, I will give you a whole information about that. But we went to Target, Walmart, and Marshalls. So we'll do that first. Uh, Walmart, which is essential stuff for the house, cat food, toilet paper, boring stuff, Brita filter. Um, do you guys have any of the new Brita pictures? I know they have like a new one coming out. I have the old Brita filter, but I have the Brita, Brita pictures. So that's not, that's what I use, but. So I have nice clean water, um, a toilet bowl thing to keep my toilet nice and clean and have blue water, um, some medicine because my baby is getting sick so I gotta give him some medicine at uh, daytime and nighttime so you can't have him get sick. Um, and then I picked up this movie, I had it in my collection but I can't remember where it went. And that's Step Brothers for $374. Hilarious movie. But I don't know what I did with it in my collection. And then I picked up uh, some food for me to eat uh, tonight for dinner. Like a little wrap. Um, and then I picked up this. Some of you guys have had these. They're called Quest Bars. This one's chocolate brownie protein bar just to have in my bag if I'm hungry. Because I'm always out when I'm always like when I'm hungry. I never have anything to eat in my bag. So I wait till I get home and I'm like starving. So I have that to eat. And then part one of being spoiled for my anniversary, um, I have an Xbox One now. I had a PlayStation 4. I did not like it. I didn't like the system. It was okay. I just had no one to play with. Um, and I wanted to play with my hubby. And he has Xbox One. And no one really had, I had never anything to play with. No one would play with me. So I got an Xbox One. The uh, one terabyte uh, Xbox One S white. I love it. Um, so... Sure, baby. What do you want to say? I just want to say that you've always been an Xbox girl. You were just very, very confused <laughs> and thought you wanted a PS4. You like Halo too much. You can't go to P PlayStation. Yes, baby. I love you. I love you, too. Have a good video, and thank you for taking care of me. I appreciate it. You're welcome. I like when you take care of me when I'm sick. You're welcome, baby. Oh, here. Okay, and this was hardly spoiling you. <laughs> Put it over there. Honestly, the $130, like, Michael Kors bag, I, I, if I had the money, I would have got a few. It's okay, it. baby. Okay, so I picked up this because this is the game that I wanted. Uh, this was, I cannot wait for the second Red Dead Redemption 2 to come out. I've been waiting for it to come out for like years now, so I can't wait. I still have yet to pre-order. I, I, I need to get my butt on and pre-order it. But um, this is Red Dead Redemption Game of the Year Edition, Xbox One. Um, includes Red Dead Redemption and Undead Nightmare. Picked this up at Walmart. I think it was on sale for 14 Really good deal, so he picked it up for me, and I cannot wait to take it out of the wrapper and play it. Um, I've got a couple of games that I'm going to show you guys uh, in my probably big haul, because I bought a lot of stuff this month. It's probably a haul, so I got that, and that was all at Walmart. Now, again, I'm going to say my biggest part, well, his biggest part that he got me last, because I'm so super excited about it. Um, so I'm going to save that one for last put it over there i don't know if you guys saw it yet um so target because that's where we went um he got me these cute mini uh mickey earrings from the mini mickey mini or mickey uh collection from target they're really cute they're six bucks i love them um and then all I picked out because i wasn't able to really spend any money because he wouldn't let me <laughs> um i picked out this cute little mini bag, I can say mini, Mickey bag, makeup bag, that was super cute and really nice, she made me just put some 
I was probably gonna put my charger in here and some other little goodies in here I thought was cute. And then I got two things for my Planet Buddies, which they're probably already gonna see, but it says okay, but ice cream first. I got these two things for my Planet Buddies, it's ice cream pen and notebook. So I got that for them. And that was all that I was allowed to spend because every time I tried to put something on the thing to pay, he was like, nope, I'll take care of it. Nope, I'll take care of it. I'm like, no, I can pay for this. It's okay. And he wouldn't let me pay for it. Um, so, case in point, I went to pay for this. Ugh. I went to pay for this book. Stephen King's The Outsiders. This is a really big book because Outsiders Outsider. Outsider. It's huge. It's like 500 and something pages, I think, or is it 5,000? No, it's 500, but it looks like it's a lot bigger. Um, I was reading a sample of this, and it sounds amazing. It's about this guy, this town. Um, a gruesome murder takes place of an 11-year-old boy, and the person that does it, like, you already know who it is. Uh, he is a good guy. Everybody doesn't think it's him. They're so in shock that it is him because he's a good neighbor. He coaches Little League. He's just this awesome person. They can't believe it's him. But it is him. Um, and he's an airtight alibi. So how can all the evidence point to him and it be him? Um, and how can he be at two places at once? So it's supposed to be really, really good. It looks good. It reminds me of um, Stranger Things because he's like upside down maybe. But it looks really good. I cannot wait to read this. So this was $22, I think, and then I price matched it with Amazon for like $18. Put it down the register. I'm like, okay, go, go grab my money to pay for it. He's like, nope, slams his money down first. So he paid for this too. I'm like, oh my God, I can't pay for anything. Then, you all know that I'm obsessed with Harry Potter. I saw this the other day when I was in Target by myself. I told him about it. I said, <coughs> it's $24 in the store. $20 on Amazon. And I still think that's expensive for what it is. It's very, very cute. I'm not going to lie, but it's very expensive for what it is. He bought it for me. I'm like, you're crazy. He's like, no, you got to drink water out of it. I know you'll use it. And I know you love Harry Potter. I'm like, but that's so much money. Okay. I wish I could. I wish I had the bottle that I was using before because you should see it. Babe, do you have the uh, bottle that I was using before? Hold on, guys. Okay, this was the bottle I was using before. This cute little uh, cold, it's still actually cold. Um, tall, what's this called? I think the brand is tall. 16, I think it's 16 ounces. Uh, bottle that I got from um, uh, Walmart for like seven bucks, I think it was. I'm thirsty. Um, worked good, I liked it. Now, I have to drink like four of those to get my daily allowance of water. This one is a Tervis uh, insulated cup, BPA free, dishwasher safe, 20 ounce cup, okay? $20 for this cup. <laughs> he paid for it. He's crazy. I cannot believe this. He bought this for me. Pops open like this. Okay, I can open it. Oh, I can open it now. There we go. Pops open like that. You drink your water like that. I could not believe it was $24 in store, but we price matched it with Amazon for $20. And he bought it for me. I couldn't believe it. I was like, babe, you're killing me. He was like, no, you deserve to get spoiled. It's our anniversary. I'm like, I know that, but still. I love Harry Potter, but not $20 worth, not enough to pay $20 for a water bottle. Like, jeez. But, ugh, it's still so cute. Okay. Now on to what you guys all have all been waiting for, and I've been waiting for it to show you guys. I've never bought a designer brand bag. I bought like Kipling, I bought like stuff like that, like, you know, a little bit name brands. I never bought like a name brand bag. I was in uh, Marshall's the other day, again, uh, by myself, told them, hey, they had this Michael Kors bag, it was kind of cute, it was, you know, it was pink. Um, it was a nylon bag, it was cute. I just, I don't know if I want to get it or not. I'm like, it's 50 bucks. I'm like, it's not an ex, it's not an expensive bag. But I mean, it's, it's, it's an okay bag. Um, by any means, it's not like high end expensive. So I show it to him. He's like, you know what? I'm going to buy it for you for, for our, our anniversary. Because the bag I was supposed to get was going to be a Kipling. Um, Kipling Defia on Amazon. 
Uh, but the print I wanted sold out. So he ended up getting me this bag and I absolutely love it so far. I'm just a little worried because I believe it is nylon. Um, and someone says that nylon can get water stains. I believe there's no information on this bag. I'm not sure. It might be inside, but here it is. I'm hoping there's some information inside because I don't know anything about this bag. But it is the Michael Kors. I don't know the name of it because I don't think there's anything inside of it. I just know the lady had to unhook it and take it in and give it to the lady so we didn't think we were stealing it. We have paper. Paper. Oh yeah, this there's a tag inside. Paper. And more paper. Inside is huge. It has a dog leash for your keys. This is called the Michael Kors, Michael Kors Nylon Crestly Ultra Pink LG TZ Tote. It retails for $129. It's very, very soft. I love it. I'm not sure if these straps, if, these leather, if this is the kettle leather straps or if this is just leather straps. I don't know. Um, I'm going to have to read up on the actual uh, tags that are here. See if they say anything about it. Um... Inside, I don't know if you can see, it's very roomy and spacious. I love that it zips all the way up. I didn't even check to make sure it zipped properly, but it zips all the way up. It has a nice big front zipper pocket so I can put all my bus pass and my headphones and probably my phone because it's a huge enough pocket. Big pocket in the back with a snap. And it's bright pink, which is awesome because I love bright pink. When I showed it to him online, I was like, this is the bag I, I, that, that I saw at Marshall's. What, what do you think? He's like, that bag is totally you. It's bright pink. It's totally you. I'm like, you think so? He's like, yeah. So we went back and got it. And I'm so glad we did. I can't wait to do a what's in my purse video. It's huge. I love it. My first designer bag. So cute. Oh, and it's got feet on the bottom. So when you put this puppy down, it doesn't get dirty. It has little feet. So we can tap dance. <laughs> my cat's like what are you doing uh but yeah i'm so excited i love this bag so much and i've yet to use it but i cannot wait i had to like baby it when we got home like while we were out because we were caught in the rain and uh i didn't know if it was gonna get stained in the rain because of the coated because of the uh canvas i wasn't sure but uh just sitting just seeing it i love it I was thinking about it, and I need you guys' opinions. I was thinking about putting my pins on it that I have, like my book pins. But I don't know if I want to put put pins in the bag. What do you guys think? I don't know. I'm kind of like, it's a designer bag. Do you really want to poke holes in it? Like, I don't know. I like that it's nice and, like, wipeable, especially with my stepson being around. Like, I don't want to have a nice bag and him ruin it. Yeah, I'm so excited. I love it. I cannot wait to use it. It stands up without having anything in it. I can't wait. And especially, I bought this cute little thing to like match. Not really match, match, but kind of like the same material. But yeah, I'm gonna go so I can actually use my bag. I'm so excited. And thank you, baby, for it. I love it. And happy two years. And I love you so much. Mwah. All right, guys. I'll see you later. Like I always say, keep calm, read on, plan on, shop on, and be nice and kind to each other. Bye, guys.